Hey guys, just picked the uh, new RX570 card up. Um, let me show it to you real quick. Alright, so there she is. Nitro Sapphire RX570. Here she is in the box here. Let me pull her out real quick. Alright, it's got a nice aluminum back plate there. Let me turn her right side up. It's a nice looking card. It's very uh, much heavier than my uh, MSI Aero cards. Whoa, don't we want to break the, break the thing before I get her up here? There's the front. Alright, she's brand new. So, what I'm going to do is um, so I'll get this installed tonight, and I should have some data by uh, tomorrow sometime, and I'll put this all in the video, and we'll jump into the computer and check it out later on. All right, guys, so I will see you inside the computer. Take care, guys. Okay, guys, so I've installed the card. Um, it took me hours. I don't know if there's something wrong with my motherboard or what, but I did have all three cards going on the um, on the rig, running nice hash for a little bit. So then I, you know, switched it over to SMOS. It ran for a little bit, and then one of the GPUs, which is the one on the riser, just decided to stop working and gave me an error in SMOS. So. I've taken that off right now, so all I'm doing is running the new 570 and the uh, 560 on the rig right off the motherboard. I was up to probably midnight last night fooling around with it. I just didn't feel like screwing with it anymore. I did BIOS mod the cards. Um, so right now, the RX 560 is doing 11.87 mega hash. 570 is 24.54 mega hash. I haven't done any, done any overclocking or anything like that, so I'll get to that later, I guess. Uh, it's been up for a little over 11 hours. Seems to uh, be running good, so I'm going to have to mess with that probably sometime this weekend, see if I can't get that third card in there and get it going. Again, still mining Ethereum, converting it to Verge. Um, I just... Just cashed out this morning 256 Verge to uh, my external wallet. So now I've mined so far with this rig 467 worth of Verge, which is pretty good in a couple weeks, I guess. Yeah, that's probably about it, a couple weeks. I do have um, my motherboard's coming in for the other uh, old card I had, that HD7970. All that stuff should be in probably by the end of next week. Here's my profit loss. Um, I'm going to do it by on a weekly basis. So what I've done now is I've broken it down per week. Um, the first week with just the 560s, you know, this is the average 59 cents a day roughly per card after uh, power cost so that's about a dollar 19 a day for just those two here in week two stats are just getting started but this uh 570 is at a 74 cents right now that will go up i mean it's, it's only been on for like i said 11 hours so I'll let it run for a few days and I should get a better uh, idea of the numbers and what that car is doing. And one of these 560s is actually offline right now, but it was online yesterday, so that's why it's still included. But I'm hoping this profit loss per day of $1.84 goes up to more or less roughly $3, I'm hoping, because this 570 right here, as we saw over in simple miner is doing over double the uh, mega hash of the 560 alone so once I get that other 560 working hopefully I should have what is that 36 
should be about 48 mega hash total going which uh, is pretty good I guess but anyways guys it's just a uh, quick update of what's going on um, if you all have any questions feel free to leave them in the uh, comments section below this is your first time here thanks for uh, watching be sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon for future updates uh, if you liked the video hit the like button and if you didn't no. All right, guys. Again, thanks for watching. Um, this is a little bit out of the norm. I usually don't do videos on the weekends, but I just did a quick update. Probably have another video back out on Monday for you. Hopefully, I'll have that 560 squared away and figure it out. Okay, guys. Take care. See you later. Bye.